Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. This is another video from chapter number two, EDC's book by Mr. Ballstead. And here we'll be discussing and chapter question 35, Clippers. And for this, a student has requested, especially difficulty in part B of the question. See? This is the question. These are the two networks that we have to solve. The input signal is 8 volt plus and minus sinusoidal signal. So let's do the first one. This is the circuit. We apply the positive half cycle first of all. When we apply positive half cycle, this becomes positive, this negative. The positive of the battery is touching the positive of the diode. Therefore, the diode will become forward bias. And so we replace the diode by a 0 0.7 volt battery. This will become our circuit. And now output you can see you can directly write from here. It is 4.7 volt. But I would recommend that we would always follow the KVL rules. So don't make any mistake. We'll write the KVL equation. We'll write, starting from here, minus 4, then minus 0 0.7, and then plus V0 equals zero and therefore v0 is equal to 4.7 volt now how do we plot this we bring the input signal and draw a line at 4.7 volt the top part is rejected so this is the answer the maximum volt is 4.7 volt now similarly for the negative half now the sign will change negative at the top positive at the bottom negative making this diode reverse bias so it will become an open circuit and we know that in open circuit whatever is the input voltage uh, the output will be same so it reproduce the input therefore our negative input is negative 8 so the output will also be negative 8 volt same shape so the total now will be the sum of these two positive and negative half so the final answer will look like this and this is how the solution manual has also given the answer. Okay, now <clears throat> we come to the B part. Uh, B part will follow the same technique. We applying uh, the uh, positive half, so positive here, negative here. This positive making the diode forward bias. So we can replace it by a 7 volt, 0.7 volt battery. And from here, you can see that the V out is just this battery, 0 0.7 volt. And to get that, we just draw a line here of 0 0.7. So the output will look like this. This is for the positive half. Now coming for the negative half. In the sign, negative at the top, positive at the bottom. This negative is making the diode first bias. It will behave like an open circuit open circuit now the output while writing the output we have to be careful here in the previous example we said that when it is an open circuit whatever is the input that will be the output but here the input is not only this 8 volt signal rather it also includes a 0 a 3 volt battery this hole is the input so it is better that we write the kvl equation so we starting from here, 0 plus 8. Voltage drop in the register will be 0 because no current is flowing. So we're getting 0 for that. Then plus 3. And then plus V0. And from here, V0 is negative 18 volt. Now how do we draw negative 18 volt? This is negative 8. So we have to actually pull this whole signal down by 3 volt. So it will be look, looking like this, that we have pull down the signal by 3 volts. So we're starting from negative 3 here and this is negative 8. So the total will be negative 11 volts. Now to um, make it neat, we just color this portion also. So it will be like this. This is for the uh, negative half. We already had the positive half like this. So adding these two will get the complete answer. So the complete answer will be as shown here. 
A similar answer has been shown in this manual, except that their values are different because this three volt battery, instead of three volts, they have used four volt battery. But the same shape you are getting. I hope you have been able to follow this. Uh, please make your comments about this, share with your friends, and like and subscribe. Thank you.